Welcome to the Craps Lab. Let's talk about probability, true odds, payouts, and the house advantage. House advantage. What is it? House advantage is the expected outcome based on the odds provided for a specific event. Knowing the house advantage, the casino is confident in the long run they are going to be profitable. Every bet has a built-in advantage because of the odds they provide. Credit. WizardofOdds.com. I want to give WizardofOdds.com a huge thanks for putting together a comprehensive list of bets and their house advantages. That is the basis of, if not exactly, the information I am providing in this video. Here's the link. I will include it in the video description. Basic craps bets. There are several basic craps bets that pay one to one. They include pass line bet, come bet, don't pass bet, don't come bet, and the field. The tour 12 pays double, and 12 may pay triple in some location. Pass line. The pass line pays 1 to 1. On the come out throw, it wins on a 7 or 11. It loses on a 2, 3, or 12. Any other result sets the point. The shooter must throw that number again before a 7 to win. Pass line, come. Come out win equals 6 out of 36 for a 7 winner, plus 2 out of 36 for an 11 winner, for a total of 8 out of 36 opportunities on the come out roll to win. Come out loss equals 1 out of 36 for a 2, plus 2 out of 36 for a 3, plus 1 out of 36 for a 12, for a total of 4 out of 36 possible combinations to lose on the come out roll. The 24 remaining come out roll outcomes 36 possible outcomes minus 8 come out wins minus 4 come out losses become the point. To win, the shooter has to roll the point again before the 7. Let's take a look. After the point is established, we need to determine the probability of rolling the point again before a 7 for all possible box numbers. In this formula, probability is abbreviated as PR. The probability of 4 times the probability of 4 before 7 plus the probability of 5 times the probability of 5 before the 7 plus the probability of 6 times the probability of 6 before the 7 plus the probability of 8 times the probability of 8 before 7 plus the probability of 9 times the probability of 9 before 7 plus the probability of 10 times the probability of 10 before 7. Let's break down the calculation for the 4. Three combinations of a 4 on the next roll. Six combinations of a seven on the next roll. Four before a seven equals the probability of four times the probability of four over the probability of four plus the probability of seven equals three out of 36 times three out of 36 over three out of 36 over three, six out of 36 equals three out of 36 times three over 36 over nine over 36 equals three over 36 times three over nine. Back to the formula. This is how it breaks down. Point before a 7 equals, for the 4, 3 over 36 times 3 over 9, plus, for the 5, 4 over 36 times 4 over 10, plus, for the 6, 5 over 36 times 5 over 11, plus, for the 8, 5 over 36 times 5 over 11, plus, for the 9, 4 over 36 times 4 over 10, plus, for the 10, 3 over 36 times 3 over 9. Reduce to the following, dividing out 36. Point before a 7 equals 2 over 36 times 9 over 9 plus 16 over 9 plus 25 over 11. Point before a 7 equals 2 over 36 times 990 over 990 plus 1584 over 990 plus 2250 over 990. Breaking down further to 2 over 36 times 4824 over 990 or 9648 over 35640. Putting it all together, the probability of a pass line come bet winning is equal to the come out roll win probability plus establishing a point and win probability. Pass line come bet win is equal to 8 over 36 plus 9648 over 35640 equals 244 over 495. Pass line come bet losing equals 1 minus 244 over 495.
House advantage. The house advantage equals the probability of win times the win amount plus the probability of losing times the loss amount. House advantage equals 244 over 495 times $1.01 1 plus 251 over 495 times $1 lost. The house advantage equals minus 7 over 495 or minus 1.414%. That was easy, right? Don't pass bar. The don't pass bar pays one to one and is the opposite of the pass line, typically betting against the shooter. On the come out roll, the don't pass bar wins on a roll of two or three. It pushes, no win, no loss, on a roll of 12. It loses on a roll of seven or 11. Any other roll results in establishing the point. If the shooter rolls a seven before rolling that number again, the don't pass bar bet wins. If the shooter rolls their point before a seven, your don't pass bar bet loses. Don't pass, don't come. Come out win equals one out of 36 chances for a two plus two out of 36 chances for a three equals three out of 36 chances to, for a come out win. A come out loss equals six out of 36 for a seven plus two out of 36 for an 11 for a total of eight out of 36 chances to lose on the come out bet. A come out push is equal to 1 out of 36 for a 12. The 24 remaining come out roll outcomes, 36 possible outcomes, minus 3 come out wins, minus 8 come out losses, and 1 come out push become the point. To win, the shooter has to roll a 7 before rolling the point again. Let's take a look. After the point is established, we need to determine the probability of rolling a 7 before rolling the point again for all possible box numbers. Probability of 4 times the probability of 7 before a 4 plus the probability of 5 times the probability of 7 before 5 plus the probability of 6 times the probability of 7 before 6 plus the probability of 8 times the probability of 7 before 8 plus the probability of 9 times the probability of 7 before 9 plus the probability of 10 times the probability of 7 before 10. Let's break down the calculation for the 4. 6 combinations of a 7 on the next roll, 3 combinations of a 4 on the next roll, so a 7 before a 4 equals probability of 4 times probability of 7 over probability of 7 plus probability of 4 equals 3 over 36 times 6 over 36 over 6 over 36 plus 3 over 36 reduced to 3 over 36 times 6 over 36 over 9 over 36 reduced further to 3 over 36 times 6 over 9. So back to the formula. This is how it breaks down. 7 for the point equals, for a 4, 3 over 36 times 6 over 9, plus for the 5, 4 over 36 times 6 over 10, plus for the 6, 5 over 36 times 6 over 11, plus for the 8, 5 over 36 times 6 over 11, plus for the 9, 4 over 36 times 6 over 10, plus for the 10, 3 over 36 times 6 over 9. Reduce to the following by dividing out 36. 7 for the point equals 2 over 36 times 18 over 9 plus 24 over 10 plus 30 over 11. 7 for the point equals 2 over 36 times 1980 over 990 plus 2376 over 990 plus 2700 over 990 equals 2 over 36 times 7056 over 990 equals 14,112 over 35,640. Putting it all together, the probability of don't pass, don't come bet winning equals come out roll win probability plus establishing a point and win probability. Don't pass, don't come win equals 3 over 36 plus 14,112 over 35,640 reduces to 2,847 over 5,940. Don't pass, don't come, lose, or push equals 1 minus 2847 over 5940 plus 1 over 36 equals 2928 over 5940. House advantage. The house advantage equals the probability of win times the win amount times the probability of losing times the loss amount. For a don't pass, don't come, house advantage equals 2847 over 5940 times $1 for a win plus 29.28 over 59.40 times $1 for a loss. The house advantage equals minus 81 over 
equals minus 1.364% house advantage. Field bet. The field bet pays one to one and gives the player a win if any of the following numbers are rolled on the next roll. 2, 3, 4, 9, 10, 11, or 12. The 2 and 12 pay double if they are rolled, and some casinos pay triple on the 12. This is a one-time roll, meaning it wins or loses on the next roll of the dice. Field. The field is a multiple number combination bet, where the better wins on any roll of 2, 3, 4, 9, 10, 11, or 12, and loses on any roll of 5, 6, 7, or 8. If 2 and 12 pay 2x, house advantage equals $2 times the probability of 2 plus the probability of 12 plus $1 times the probability of 3 plus the probability of 4 plus the probability of 9 plus the probability of 10 plus the probability of 11 plus minus $1 loss times probability of 5 plus the probability of 6 plus the probability of 7 plus the probability of 8. This breaks down to $2 times 1 over 36 plus 1 over 36 plus $1 times 2 over 36 plus 3 over 36 plus 4 over 36 plus 3 over 36 plus 2 over 36 plus minus $1 for a loss times 4 over 36 plus 5 over 36 plus 6 over 36 plus 5 over 36. The house advantage equals $2 times 2 over 36 plus $1 times 14 over 36 for a win plus minus $1 loss times 20 over 36 equals a negative 5.556 house advantage. If the 12 pays 3x, the house advantage drops in half to minus 2.778%. House advantage equals $3 times 1 over 36 for the 12, plus $2 times 1 over 36 for the 2, plus $1 times 14 over 36, plus minus $1 for a loss times 20 over 36 equals minus 2.778% house advantage. Thanks for watching. This video covers the house advantage basic bets. Please watch the other videos on house advantage, house advantage basics, place bets, center bets, bonus bets. Please hit that like and subscribe. Thanks.